Hello, and welcome to the first episode of my Museum to Spain series. This summer, I spent about three weeks in Spain, and I went to many different museums. I decided to make a series talking about some of them, as many of these museums are not well known, but they hold many interesting objects and are definitely worth a visit. In this episode, we're talking about the Archaeological Museum of Seville, or in Spanish, El Museo Archeológico de Sevilla. First, a little bit of history about the museum itself. Its first venue was actually the Royal Alcazar of Seville, around 1975. The museum was then moved to El Convento de la Merced, an ancient convent for the 13th century. In 1880, the museum was officially inaugurated and opened to the public, and it proved an immediate success. However, the museum shared a convent with another museum and was quickly run out of space. To solve this problem, the city of Seville gave the National Ministry of Education a new building in Maria Luisa Park. On May 25, 1946, the new venue was inaugurated and the museum remains there today. So, what can you see in the museum today? The objects on display span roughly from prehistoric Seville to the early beginnings of Muslim Al-Andalus. That being said, the main attractions are definitely the Roman artifacts that make up the majority of the museum. They have some incredibly well-preserved statues and mosaics that are arranged in breathtaking rooms. You really do feel like you're stepping into the villa of a wealthy patron of the arts from antiquity. This museum was one of the most visually impressive I went to, as you will see in these pictures. There's not much else to say in the museum, but I do highly recommend it if you're going to Seville. It is free entry if you're a citizen of the European Union, and one euro fifty otherwise. It is open from 9 a.m. to 9 p.m. every day except on Mondays and bank holidays. It is in a very accessible part of the city, close to the Plaza de España, which you're going to want to see as well. That's going to be all from me for this video. I will be leaving you with some music as the pictures continue. Any and all feedback is appreciated down in the comment section. I only use one source for this video, but I will put it in the description anyways. Thank you for watching.